number one. Let's get to it. The brown paper bag of shame. The big issue of week eight. I've received no small amount of questions, comments, and concerns about Pittsburgh's get-ups. If you didn't see them, they went back in time with these 30s throwbacks. And the tweets have been coming fast and furious ever since. As the uniform monitor, this is perhaps the most significant ruling I've had. Maybe ever will have. And it's not a decision I make lightly. So I'm not going to stand here and make lame jokes comparing the Steelers to Bumblebees. I'm not going to say Troy Pollen Malu or Stingy Hood or Beef Miller. I'm not going to say a ref got stung by Ben Roethlis buzzer. No, a situation like this calls for sober, serious-minded thought. Honey, get it, because bees, they like honey. Anywho, so what do I think? Trick or treat? Do I like them? No, I don't. I love them. They're terrific. Yeah, I said it. Just because you've never seen anything like them before doesn't make them bad. Are you freaking out of your mind, Damashek? Scream all you want, D'Angelo. If you don't like those get-ups, I got something for you. No, it's not the leftover material from the Steelers' pants on Sunday. It's the brown paper bag of shame. You know what goes great with them? These. Look at those. That's terrific. You mean that's not awesome? You're out of your mind. Here it is for all you fashion backwards people. Till next time, try not to embarrass yourselves. Shame.